Hey guys, welcome to the introduction to the first episode of Developing with the Theta SD2. So the importance of this tutorial is that you're going to get set up with Dart, you're going to uh, start using the Rico Theta API, and you're going to make your first command with the API, the info command, uh, which is going to allow you to access some of the information that's uh, within the camera. So by the end of the video tutorial, which is linked in the description, you will be able to use the info command. So the info command is going to give you a lot of information about the camera. It's going to tell you the model number, the serial number, what firmware is using, what firmware it's using. And this is just interesting information to know, but the important thing is that you've successfully used your use the API to issue a very basic command to the camera. And we're only gonna build off the framework that you establish here to make a more and more complex and useful app. Now, the link in the description is gonna take you to this page. And I just wanted to go over some of the features so that you know um, the correct way to proceed through this tutorial. So you'll be following this video here, the first video. You're going to click the link and it's going to take you to a YouTube video that's going to detail building a basic application with Dart from the ground up all the way from nothing to what I just showed you where you can just type in the command line uh, info and it will give you the camera's info. If for whatever reason you follow the tutorial to the dot and it's not working and you don't know what's wrong, we've also included the command line test and so this is our GitHub repository that has all of the code that we've already written and that we know works. So if you can't get your code to work, go ahead and download the command line tests and then try to run the info command. If it still doesn't work, it's likely that you have a problem uh, with your Dart setup. You maybe didn't install all the right packages. Maybe you're not connected to the camera. There's probably some issue that's not related to your code and more to your system shoot us uh, something in the comments and we can try to help you out with that. Um, and also the last thing that I wanted to highlight, this this written API guide here. And this written API guide is essentially a written version of the video tutorial. And so if you're already familiar with API and you want to move through the tutorial faster, you can always go, go ahead and click this written, written API guide and just read along at your own pace. So just to recap, by the end of the video tutorial linked in the description, you'll be able to run the info command and get some basic information from the camera. And importantly, when you click that link in the description, you're gonna to go to this page and be sure to follow this tutorial here to get started with Dart and start uh, using the API. So let us know if you have any questions, um, either via email or by these YouTube comments, and we'll try to keep you guys updated as we uh, roll out additional content.